The other thing we're often told about KCTS 9 Cooks is the fact that the, oh, these shows repeat, you know, over the 16 years, all the hits we've had, we keep repeating them. What other station can do that except right here on public television? So thank you for making that happen, for making that phone call and going to our website, the DVD and the cookbook. So right now, I was hoping we'd have some time that maybe our in-kitchen chef here thank could have you. some fun and have okay. a recipe with us. So Carol Durth here from Sizzle Work School, Bellevue, is uh, going to help us with a side dish. Chili corn. Chili corn. You're going to be my sidekick. How about that? Sidekick. All right. Okay. So first thing we're going to do is we've heated some olive oil in a skillet here and put in some onion. We're going to cook this onion just until it's soft. Mm -hmm. um, and with that onion, we're going to put in a pasilla chili. Now, these guys right here are pasilla chilies. They're not hot, but they just they have a very unique flavor here. Try that. Good sidekick. All right. Put that right in there. Now we're thinking of chili that's got to simmer for hours and hours and hours here, Carol. No, this is super fast. Right on. So this side is, dish, it works. This is fresh, fast food. I love that. So we're going to cook this just until it's soft. Meanwhile, we're going to get some corn. I like to just use frozen corn for this. Okay. It, this particular one that I have here in this bowl is white corn. You could use yellow corn. You can use the little baby corn. Whatever you like or whatever you have in your freezer is great. Just thaw it and drain it, and that's it. That's all there is to it. Okay. So as soon as this is nice and soft, we're going to add our corn. It's already smelling fantastic. <laughs> you have such great rhythm here. Everything just flows here, making this chili corn. And then we're going to add a little salt and pepper to this. A little black pepper. If you wanted a kick to this, you could uh, finely mince a jalapeno chili, put it in too. Okay. But this is just a lovely side dish for any sort of a Southwest meal. Okay. And when this is all heated through and those onions and chilies are soft, the very last thing we're going to do is finish it with a little bit of cream. Okay. And this is going to make the whole thing come together. Sometimes I've done this with little pearl onions, which you just get in the freezer case. And there we are. Are you cooking like this at your house every day? Um, when I'm home, yes. Really? Yeah. Yeah. And I you don't do. think it's like all your work that you're taking home and No, and that's my home kitchen is really where I do all my research. Oh, okay. My my husband is my guinea pig. <laughs> <laughs> it's great. So that's pretty much it. We're just gonna let that heat through. And while that's doing that, I'm gonna show you how we're going to present this. Okay. So I have another one of those pasilla chilies which we roasted. Not till it was completely blistered, but just until it was a little bit soft. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to cut this in half. And one of these halves is going to go right there. And th 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 that's perfect. That's not that's perfect. And we're rotten just, or overgrown? or No, nope, this is perfect. We just take want. those little seeds out and we're going to serve our chili corn right in there. So how about that? Really? Mm-hmm. Here we go. This is ready. Oh, you said this was going to be a fast side dish. I didn't believe you with all the corn and... Oh, yeah, little hay. Yeah. I know. Isn't this great? So here Amazing. we go. We're going to pile it right into this chili. And you could put a teeny bit of cheese on this and run it under the broiler for a second if you wanted. Mm -hmm. But there you go. <laughs> Isn't that glorious? That's great. Look at that. So there's a chili oh, that's Two and a half minutes? <laughs> two and a half minutes. You can do this. Yeah. This is, you know... Chop an onion. You can even buy onions already chopped. Don't be intimidated. I mean, just again. Would you the, like yours in a chili? Well, why not? Go ahead and put it in there. And okay, we'll, we'll put some we'll in do a it chili. All together. But again, these are viewers and friends like Carol that show you these recipes and make it fun. They make it simple. You know, think of the. Here we go. The gift idea here for family and friends who like to cook with a DVD in the book. And this is a gift that'll come back to you. You know. Oh yeah. It's never bad to have a friend who knows how to cook. Oh, it's always a great thing. Right, here we go. Mmm. I can't believe how fast you whipped up this side dish. I know. And it's just and flavor and the pepper sweet and, all and, and sweet and again, and yummy with the, and fantastic. With the Southwest uh, recipe ideas that you have. Again, and, and as we started this program here, this on the side with KCTS 9 Cooks, Again, the importance of a side dish, we throw something simple, maybe a piece of bread and a salad, yeah. and a glass of ice water, 
but the keep side it simple, dish, but keep it flavorful. Yeah, but the side dish, what's the goal? Again, the side dish is to do what? To support the rest of the meal. Okay. So make it pretty, make it flavorful, don't make it too complicated. Um, and we have lots of great recipes in this book, so call in, get the book, get the DVD. You're yeah. going to want to do that. You just discovered a way to uh, really make that vacant space on the plate. Yep. Uh, yeah, give it a little splash, give it a little spotlight. And with all these recipes, we want to thank all the viewers for contributing to uh, on the side here with these great recipes and more programs. You want more programs? You have to support it like you have now for yeah. about 16 years. Call us at 1-800-443-1999 and online at kcts9.org. And uh, Carol and I are always telling people, go to the website so that way you know what show we're working on. You want to submit a, submit a recipe and be on one of these programs. Yep. It's fun. It's simple to do. There, there's no rehearsal. It's just just like being at home. And become you got a, Carol here. Become myself. a KCTS side cook. Yeah, side and kick. it's just great fun. And your friends will love it and you'll love it. And we just want to thank you for being here and supporting it. And uh, good cooking always. Good cooking always. And try these recipes. Enjoy. Can I have another bite? Oh, please. <laughs>